So we are back. Um, I did a full wipe last time. So you don't need to see that experience of me staying at my phone. Um, oh, I forgot about this. Uh, but anyway, I was just going to kind of show off SOSM a little bit here on video. Um, basically, just wanted to highlight some key features. Um, you're looking at Mean ROM, ICS. Uh, Mickey XDA has done a great job of building an awesome ROM, and uh, I talked to him, and he said, you know, feel free to use it as you see fit. So I'm basically just gonna keep up with his updates as best I can, and uh, just remove sense, and you know, uh, give you guys out there plenty of options as far as launchers and other features go. Hopefully, Kern will start rolling out soon. I know we're gonna have to wait for source code before those things really start going and I know Chad Goodman hit a wall recently with some people flaming him on XDA. I just get, I'm just getting back into the 3D scene. I've been out for a while so um, but I, I see a lot of good development and that's good. Um, yeah I really can't tell you what all I plan to do with this project but I definitely plan to uh, keep it up to date that's for sure and give you guys a good nonsense around because I see a lot of people in the main ROM thread saying, oh, I flashed Apex, or, you know, I installed Apex over Sense, and, uh, you know, that's exactly what I wanted. Well, here you go. This is exactly what you want. You, you know, minus the Sense running in the background. Uh, so here we go. It's about to boot up. And there you go. Uh, I've already messed it a little bit. Ah, uh, that's all right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Still my Evo 4G as my main phone. Um, oh, hey, it fixed itself. Sweet. Um, yeah, so this is I got the live wallpaper since I don't really care about battery. Um, but yeah, I mean, this is Apex. This is what I chose in Aroma, and obviously you can choose what you want. And you know, you can see, you know, barely three pages of installs, and you can see how many of those were downloaded. Um, comes with ES File Explorer, DSP Manager, uh, Flash Player, and uh, Wi-Fi Tether, for those of you that need to tether 4G. Um, but yeah, everything works, surprisingly. I mean, I haven't been able to test 4G since I don't use it, uh, but just knowing that 3G works is pretty uh, amazing. And you can see here, all of these are 3D photos, and like this one here, I know, you can't see. But you can see, like, it wouldn't be doing that if it was 2D. So I'll just do that and just show you. But yeah, it definitely works, and it works good, too. It works better, in my opinion, than it did on Gingerbread. Because my pictures would always get, you know, messed up. And they, they wouldn't look 3D. It really pissed me off. <laughs> but they work now. Um, it's got face unlock, you know, all the cool ice cream sandwich features. Um, and I also incorporated lead droid tweaks. So that's always, uh, you know, a must-have application. So, you know, be sure to check that out, uh, customize it, see fit, you know, all these HTC Sense things are pretty much pointless since we got rid of a Sense, uh, but, you know, uh, if you have the HTC lock screen, you can easily toggle it, so, you know, it's like, uh, you know, should I just install it? I could always turn it off here, uh, but, you know, if you're not going to use it, you might as well not install it. Uh, but definitely hit up these status bar tweaks, there's a lot of cool stuff here, and uh, I don't know about you guys, but these damn capacitive lights are always pissing me off. And there's actually a way to uh, dim them here, make them a little darker. Actually, I have to quick reboot the phone to get that to work and I don't feel like watching all the apps update themselves. But yeah, the, you know, just a lot of cool stuff. I mean, this is the ROM I always wanted. I always wanted an ice cream sandwich ROM that was stable. Sprint gave it to us. And I wanted stock ice cream sandwich. Obviously, HC is not going to give it to us, but they gave us the base. Well, Virgin Mobile gave us the base. <laughs> but uh, here's the base. You know, got rid of the sense. Um, and pretty much every HC application included. There's a couple things, you know, hiding here and there. But yeah, I have to say, it's, you know, very snappy. Yeah, as you can see, you know, it's swiping. I mean, obviously, you got a dual core phone here. And thanks to, you know, Mickey, his tweaks, you know, make the phone just so smooth. You know, saving battery here, and you know, it's, you know, there's so many possibilities here, and including things like my UI launcher. So you basically have, 
you know, a super stable MIUI uh, installation. Or however you pronounce it, MIUI. I don't give a crap. But anyway, here it is. Super cool. SOSM 1.3. Going up to XDA. Right, meow. Peace.